I, someone who has never seen Hannah Montana, am watching the Hannah Montana movie. With someone who is a super fan of Hannah Montana. Back when I was younger, like, Hannah Montana was one of, like, the main shows playing on Disney Channel. I was more of a fan of, like, Sweet Life and Wizards of Waverly Place. I know this show is about Miley Stewart living a double life by putting on a wig and pretending to be a pop star. But because she can take the wig off and not be the pop star whenever she wants, some might say she gets to live a great two worlds of life. I hate you so much for messing up that sentence. Did you do that on purpose? Uh -huh. Just to be annoying? Yeah. Okay. I don't think this is going to be my favorite movie of all time. Now that's disappointing. Well, because I don't like bad movies. Is it? Oh, no, 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 no. Take that sentence back. Oh, we stop. <laughs> So, Miley adapts back to life in Tennessee after getting too caught up in the celebrity lifestyle. So, she doesn't live in Tennessee? No. Does she live in Montana? No. <laughs> Get ready to be dazzled with laughs, adventure, family fun, and fabulous music. Oh my god, that's so intense. What the f***? <laughs> I'm so excited! I literally can't wait. This is gonna be the best day of my life. Do you wanna have a dramatic pressing the play button? Okay, let's get let's get this close up. Da, 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 da. This is a good opening scene as well. Billy Ray Cyrus. That's Hannah Montana actually. It's a good transformation, right? Because she looks like that first and then she gets the wig on and she looks like That was her dad. <laughs> yeah, I love that you're thinking I'm serious. That her wig? No, it's just another blonde wig. Wait. I'm sorry, but how does no one recognize her? Oh, that's so funny. They've got, they only had the budget for like 50 people. Yeah. And they didn't just frame the shot so they were all in it. You could actually see the end of the queue where they're all cramming <laughs> to get to. I think it would be more difficult than that to break into a concert. Yeah. Do you think that's a video idea? Pants, the golf cart! <laughs> you know what? That is symbolism. Yes. And that should be taught in film school, I think. So does her friend know she's Hannah Montana? Yes. So why did they need to get a ticket to go to the concert? But she was late to show up. Which I don't really get because she is, her dad is there, so he must have driven. So I don't know why she didn't go with her dad. She looks different though, doesn't she? She does, but I still think a real mainstream celebrity people would know if yeah. she changed her hair. Like, imagine like when Billie Eilish just changed <laughs> her hair to blonde, everyone was like, Whoa, this isn't Billie Eilish. She had black and green hair. I think she did say she got recognized less. But it, there's a difference between getting recognized less and not getting known at all, like yeah. living it completely unknown. It's also, I love every song that she sings. It's like, I live a double life, by the way. <laughs> I was literally going to say that. Do people not realize? She has several songs like this. Why is she just like left the stage? You get the So what was the point of the thing that happened at the start? It was her concert, showing she's a pop star. But she was filming a music video the entire time. No, 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 that was just the end bit. It's just showing what she's doing. That's all you're gonna get, now get out. <sighs> but how's he gonna get the camera back? <laughs> so now he knows she has a secret. Okay. Apparently there's a secret. <laughs> See, at school she's a normal girl. Whoa! Fabulous news, Beyonce has double ammonia and has to drop out of the New York Music Awards. You are in! Why can't they write the word Beyonce? Have you noticed that? It's because she has like the accent on the E in the subtitles. The subtitles keep writing it as Beyonce. <laughs> Beyonce, <laughs> not Beyonce! Miley! Hello, what about my birthday party? Wow. So when you have a best friend who's a world famous pop star, they don't have time for you. Who would guess? <laughs> Suffering from success again. Take them all. We'll just add them to the pile. Girls. Isn't this what it's like to be famous, Seamus? Can you uh, let us into the secret? So basically, yeah, everywhere you go, there's just a bunch of people like twice your age surrounding around you. Yes. 
giving you stuff. Oh my god. <laughs> what was on the end of that shoot? <laughs> Oh yeah, they have sweet 16s in the US. It's like a big deal, right? Like, Turning 16 is a big deal here too. Yeah, but it's like huge, huge in the US. I bought a lottery ticket on my 16th birthday. Miley, we've talked about this party since we were like 12. Four whole years. <laughs> wow. Yeah. She's just ruining her birthday pie, stealing the thunder entirely. Yeah. Well, the dramatic slow motion of walking up to her. You will never, ever, ever make it up to me. Her <laughs> It's her 16th birthday party and it's the most, it's the biggest betrayal of her whole life. You, you will never make it up to me after this. That's it. Done. Wait, did she intend to show up as Hannah Montana? No. But why did they have a whole set <laughs> ready for her to perform? And why did she perform anyway? Why didn't she just leave? Why did she just leave, take the wig off and come back? Happy birthday, y'all. We got cake over there. She literally almost ate her microphone. <laughs> Like, it was like fully like, where's my mic? I don't, I, I realized as I was thinking of it, I don't particularly want to stick a, ma a mic in my mouth. No. I, I, if someone didn't show up to my birthday party, I would, well, it's probably a bit too close to home actually. Hello, New York. Welcome to New York. Welcome to New York. Well, that can't be New York. There's a cow. <laughs> oh no. I get she's landed in Tennessee. <laughs> yes. Do they ever establish how Hannah Montana became a superstar? Or is it just like she was successful from the start? Oh, uh, that's a good question. I'm not getting back in the truck. She's actually so spoiled. I despise her. <laughs> also, the guy, I don't want to be that guy, but your wig isn't that good compared to hers. Hers is a much lighter shade of blonde. I bought it off Amazon for like 10 pounds, okay. That's what you call wig snatched. <laughs> You're really proud of that one. Did you do something to your tail? I love her country accent coming out as soon as she steps down there. Did you do something to her tail? Where's she actually from? Miley. Yeah. Stewart. Tennessee. No, Cyrus. Oh, I don't know. Look at this shot though. Oh. Gorgeous. I think the wig came off. <laughs> you think? It's me, Travis. Travis Brody. We were in the first grade together. We were in the first grade together. <laughs> Are they cousins? Seamus. I don't know, it's Tennessee. <laughs> I know Hannah Montana. Hannah Montana, really? Why are they riding horses? Why, like, this is too American for me. Like, <laughs> like this guy's got like a country accent, wearing a hat, riding horses. <laughs> little black cat named Charlie sounds a little crazy. I'm glad they're really like beating us over the head with the fact they're in Tennessee now. Yeah. You know, it was kind of funny when she landed in New York and it wasn't New York and there was a cow there. Yeah. Now it's kind of like, I get it. I want my life back, Dad. Can I have a deep, I want my life back moment in front of the whole family? Happy birthday, Grandma. Oh my God. Yikes, going into the grandma's birthday being like, I want my life back. Do me a favor, introduce yourself to Lorelai over there. She's new and a little shy. <laughs> Lorelei over there, she's shy and a little shy. <laughs> Lorelei, I didn't even clock the name. I just thought it was so embarrassing. Imagine your mum being like, I got this girl just for you, son. Yeah. I got it. Did you see that? Painful. That was so painful to watch, Vigar. I got secondhand embarrassment from that. The fact that they thought that was a good. It, it went on so long. Caterpillar in a tree, how you wonder who you'll be. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> how much of this movie do they spend in Tennessee? Oh no, it's gonna be like an hour, isn't it? The fact her fa her like being famous and stuff isn't even like a massively established storyline already either. It was literally just like one instance where a paparazzi person was chasing her around and she accidentally left her wig on and her dad was like, 
she needs to learn a lesson. And I take it she's gonna fall in love with her cousin who, uh... <laughs> Stop saying it's this guy's her cousin! Ain't nothing better than farm fresh egg for breakfast! Do you get it? Because, because she, 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 she's in Tennessee now. Hola! I can't believe they've unironically called a character Lorelai. <laughs> Do you know this girl? Sure. Oh, it's that Ooh. guy! Mm. What's he doing around here? Because Lily said where she lived. Oh, sugar. He, she did. <laughs> Not sugar. Someone just said, I got, I got quite a few complaints in my last few videos that I swear to you. The action sequences. It's of like any they have a way movie. of doing it. I'm yeah, starting yeah, yeah. to notice. Slow motion. This is my least favorite trope in family films like this. Home Alone ruined family films. Like, it's a good film, don't get me wrong. But every family film since Home Alone is just like, you know what's content? We just torture the villains. Just like anything that happens, they just get like whacked across the face and just go through the worst possible pain. I want the dirt. Trust me, I'm all over it. Aren't the jokes hitting, Seamus? The jokes are hitting so hard. Oh my god, did you know Taylor Swift is in this movie? Why didn't you say so? <laughs> Suddenly you're interested. <laughs> Where is she then? Oh, she's coming up. Doesn't tell me anything about who you are or what you feel. Wow. Who knew her cousin was such a good mu music critic? Seamus, people are gonna be so mad at the comments about this. What? Choose your cousin. Oh my god, it's doing the decom formula where oh god, the, the main abs. girl and the main guy have a scene together and he will come out with a shirt off. Yeah. There we go! <laughs> they can't kiss as well, it's the first film. We're gonna slow it down for this next song if that's alright. Oh, Taylor Swift! <laughs> Our family's closer than most. More... Secretive? Okay, I need to look this up. Is this okay. who I think it is? Sorry. Oh my god, it is. Lorelai is Jan from The Office. I was literally sat there thinking that. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't mean much to me, but. If you're five or 82, this is something you can do. I've never heard this one before. Stick it. That's impossible. <laughs> Does uh, her brother know she's Hannah Montana? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw that. <laughs> well, I didn't realize, man. I am so sorry. You are the best friend I have ever had. And when I thought that you weren't going to talk to me, that I might lose you forever. Hey, you just... couldn't lose me even if you wanted to. See, okay, now... Now I'm never going to forgive you. Can we cut you back to that know. scene? Can we cut back to that scene? <laughs> you will never, ever, ever make it up to you me. You will never make it up to me after this. I will never forgive you. Oh, a week yeah. later, <laughs> yeah. asks a huge favor of her. You could never lose me. You know what? <laughs> What's with him? Shh, come Why here. are they snapping at everyone? Everyone's just like, snap, snap. And now he's going to fall because funny. Welcome to Crowley Corners. You know, it uh, it sure would be nice to have someone to. Oh, it's gonna be cute because he's not gonna be into Hannah because he's into Miley. Isn't that gonna be it? Did I predict it again? <sighs> she already had paint on her. They have done that a couple times. Anyways, I was just wondering if. Maybe you would like to go to dinner with me this evening? Seamus, this evening? That is also the evening Hannah is going to the dinner. However, is she going to survive? I didn't even realize that. <laughs> but I guess that's what happens when you're trying to live two lives. That's such a funny coincidence, because I also have a date and a dinner with the mayor tonight. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it's Jan. I, I literally fought it the first time I saw her and I was yeah. like, no, I'm just stereotyping white woman from America. <laughs> Your offer of a concert tomorrow. Like, I, mean, you, I think at this stage, you've just got to commit to one of the plans and give your everything to it. Yeah. Rather than being at one while wanting to be at the other. Yeah. Is everything all right? I really should take this, I'm sorry. What is her phone ringtone? I, I don't... It sounds like Crazy Frog, right? Worse than Crazy yeah, Frog. Yeah, I'd respected it if she had Crazy Frog. That would've been kind of funny, actually. She took off a whole dress yeah. and put on a new dress. <laughs> and That's what I was literally going to say! <laughs> That's so f***ing creepy. Oh my god. That is so scary. Why was she standing there like a f***ing ghost? Are they really 
doing this in a revolving door. <laughs> Don't break the moment. But yes, they are. Is he heartbroken by the fact she's Hannah Montana? Whoever you are, we're done. I love that this is like a big breakup scene. They had been on like a five minute date. And Have it's you like, ever watched the Disney Channel done. original movie? <laughs> what? Miley! Are you okay? There's always hay to catch them, I swear. Yeah. I really wanted her to just die. <laughs> right, Imagine she lays there fully neck snapped and Lily just like has to call an ambulance. That's the twist. That, that's the end of the film. <laughs> Couldn't, instead of throwing this concert, yeah. Hannah Montana just donated money. They, oh, you them. know what they never touch on in the show? The fact that she's rich. Yeah. They never bring up the fact that she's rich. She surely could have just donated all the money. Yeah. Oh my god. Nobody's perfect. Oh no, it's Rockstar. Dang it, I got the song wrong, Seamus. You are an, you are an embarrassment yeah. to Hannah Montana fans. Hannah Montana? <laughs> well, I thought I was going to get the mic. I've loved being Hannah, but... Oh, no. Wait, is she gonna do the reveal in the movie? And then they never address it in the show that she's revealed who she was? You have no idea the f shock when we were watching this in the cinema. You, want, you went to see this in cinemas? Yes. I brought my... I forced my dad to come with me. <gasps> oh my god. The clap. <sighs> Oh, it's gonna be another man. Another man? I do know this Yeah. One. So, did your dad know you were gay in 2009? <laughs> Forcing you to bring you to Hannah Montana, the movie, in cinemas? I, mean, I, know I don't think this is the best song. I may not. There isn't oh like a catchy God. chorus. Just a bit slow, innit? There's always gonna be another mountain <laughs> that we have to... There's gonna be another mountain. <laughs> Please be Hannah. We'll keep your secret. <laughs> they actually did. They actually <laughs> did the Spider-Man two scene. Put the wig back on, Seamus. Put the wig back on. Hannah. 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 Flip it. Well, flip it over. I can't see your. No, flip the. No, please. Oh no! I forgot about him. Yeah. He's still. He's still in the story. <laughs> you can change your hair and you can change your clothes. Change your mind, that's just the way it goes. You can say goodbye, and you can, can say, say hello. The groundbreaking lyrics, by the way. The end! Woohoo! I feel like there was definitely a little bit of required knowledge of the series going in, because if you didn't know, like, some of the basis of Hannah Montana and, like, her living a double life, that made no sense. It wasn't what I expected the movie to be though either, like I didn't think it would all take place in Tennessee. I was a little disappointed that I feel like a lot of her friends were just kind of cut from the film. It wasn't that decom -y, which is actually I think a pretty big compliment for it. Yeah. It didn't fall into a lot of the decom tropes, it did the like shirtless love interest one. As you said it was released to cinemas so I'm not sure it was a decom, I think it was an actual just movie. So it's kind of just in the middle of my my decom my decom table that does not exist. The animation graphic right here of my Are decom table. Animation? No. Okay. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like. You can subscribe to my channel, watch another video, check out my Patreon here and in the description down below. And guys, I haven't been being honest with you. The truth is, I'm not Hannah Montana. I'm. I'm. I'm you should. Okay.